back. Today, let's solve the sixth SQL entry questions from lead codes SQL 50 entry questions. Uh, problem statement is based on join, joining two tables. Uh, there is one table called employee, there is one more table called employee UNI. You have to join these two tables uh, because the, the output, the way they want is it is a combination of uh, output one column from here, one column from here. So we have to join this table based on one key, which is a common here. So ID is here, ID is also here. So we'll join these two table based on column called ID from this table should map to ID from uh, this table. Um, what they need is the output. If you see, this is the employees uh, table, which contains ID is, is, is the first column, name is the second column. Uh, and then there is an employees, uh, employee UNE table, which has ID and then there is a unique ID. The output what they want is they want unique IDs, unique IDs, and also they want the names. Uh, and additional what they, they have mentioned is they if there is no unique ID for user, if there is no unique ID for the user, for instance, for this user, uh, there is no unique ID. How do I know? I have to, I have to, for this user, there is no unique ID. How do I know? I have to check whether this ID exists here or not. So not here, it is exist but I have to check this ID exist here in this column or not, it doesn't exist. So if you don't find any unique ID for a, a particular user, so replace that with uh, null, that's the that's what they're saying. So for first two users, Bob ID is seven, it is not here in this column of this table. So these two will be replaced with null and these will have these users, these um, uh, names have the their their names and then they have the unique IDs so we'll print out the, they will give the output their corresponding for this user if you see 11 11 if you see here 11 is here so unique ID is 2 so for this user unique ID is 2 so you will see here for this user unique ID is 2 so this what this is based on the concept of joins uh, now this works based on the left join so this uh, this will be the left table and this will be the right table and we need a uh, unique ID from this table uh, from the right table and the name from the left table uh, it is based on the concept of joins let's before that let's understand the concept of um, join so this is the, there is one nice uh, website uh, which is good to understand uh, for, for joins there are majorly industry uses three, these three major joins uh, I would say these two majorly use joins in the industry the first one is the inner join inner join is something imagine you have a table a table b uh, you want to the common between these two is the inner join in our case in our example inner join is something which is common here if you see uh, all the ids which are common here so 11 is there if, if i if i do an inner join on these two tables i'll get output something like this you know i'll get something output for 11 id 11 id unique id is 2 I'll get output something like this. Inner join I'm talking about. For 90, 90, name is this. 90, you just have to go. Unique ID is this. For 90, unique ID is this. And uh, for 3, you have 3. three For 3, uh, unique ID is 1. Right? So, the you, you, you basically go from here for 11 you check 11 here what is the unique id you printed out for 90 what is the unique id you printed so common between these two table matching wherever there is a column matching id and id here the values are matching that is a common so this is the id this is the name and this is the unique id if you go by that uh, this sorry this is the unique id last column is the unique id this is a this is what the inner join is um, left join is something you if I want to join this column with this column and this, I want to keep this as a left side what to do is you basically take all these values all these values that is what they want us to want, want us to do uh, all these wherever there is a match you print their corresponding IDs uh, as, as here you will get the values uh, for, for example unique ID if you are trying to do for all of these for all of these if you see if I if I do a uh, left join left join if I do oh sorry so I get all of these values from this table 
plus I need the unique uh, unique ID for this there is a null because there is no one here it will check it will check all the columns of left side if you see here let's go to here visualization all the columns of left side all the values of left side plus the intersection of B so here you will see all the values of left side left column you will get all the values plus for this unique ID unique ID is not there for this user how do I know uh, if you see one you try to search for one here there is no one so you will replace this with none you put the value as none here same as none and then you you check other values you will get the other values 11 for 11 for 11 you check here 11 unique ID is 2 uh, same way for uh, 2 for 90 you come here 90 it is 3 and for 3 uh, you come here uh, you come here and then it is 1 so this is the unique ID so this is the left join and there is also right join right join is something you know you first take all the values of right table so you take right table all the values of right table all the values of right table and ID is there unique ID uh, ID is there unique ID is there name you have to put right for 3 you just name you have to put all the values of right side you take there can be many numbers but as of now it's 3 it's just uh, uh, for ID 3 from ID 3 you search here ID 3 what is this is how the name comes don't get confused between between unique ID and ID so the joining happens based on ID of this column and ID of this column and for 11 you come here uh, from here from here you go you go here because I want to join right 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 join right sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry for this copy paste error for three for three you go over here you copy this name okay for 11 from here you go to 11 you copy this name uh, and from 90 you go here you copy this name this is how you print out a, a right join a right join is something where you take all the values of right column right table plus the intersection which are getting common from a left table left side table so in our case we need to do a left left join let's write the code it is very simple um, so what we have to do is we just have to uh, key is common key you know key is um, id id is the key select let's uh, let's type select select according to the coding standard select um, unique id unique id and what we need is um, unique id is from this table i'll i'll come back on this select unique id name name is here name is here from from here here comes the pro here comes employees employees I want to keep left side as I'll say e okay small e so e dot name as just to make it standard as e um, I have to join if I do just join which is an inner join join I want to join with this table I'll say this table as EU I'll mention EU from this table I'll give the name as as unique id comma this done this done this done this done and now uh, now on what key on what key on e dot e dot id equal to u dot id so if I if I do just join this this becomes this becomes this inner join which is a common between 
let's let's run and test that this is not the output which they are expecting us to do you will see the common common between these two the output which we got is the common output uh, if you see the common output this is the common output this is what we got it but what they are expecting us to do is this so instead of join which is the inner join what i have to do is i just have to use capital letter left join that's all it is very simple problem simple starting uh, easy problem of uh, sql join understand the concept this this is a very basic thing uh, at the same time it is also sometimes confusing so because on what which which column you put uh, left side which column you put right side and the id is also is is you have to which is in the right column you have to put it first so it is little confusing uh, but it is easy if you understand if you visualize and understand what is the ask uh, that's all guys uh, for this video thank you for watching see you in the next video